I'm Jeff Alpin, the Big Game Hunter. I'm the head coach for JobSearchCoachingHQ.com. That's a site where I've curated information that's going to help you find work more quickly. You, know, you can watch it, listen to it, read it. It's all designed to help you find work more quickly. I received a question from someone, and you know, people always want to know stuff like this. What is a professional way of asking a hiring manager to give me a chance? The real question is, why should they give you a chance? Now, that's going to depend upon where you are in your interviewing with this firm and where they are in their interviewing with, with people. Let me put it from their perspective, because that's really the most important one. If you're an early candidate, they're going to keep interviewing. They're not going to have any interest in being nice people and giving you a chance. Because if you fail, the hiring manager puts himself or herself at risk. Why should they do that? That's ultimately the question that you have to be able to answer in presenting this thing, this idea of them giving you a chance. What's going to be at risk for you? I know what's at risk for them. They can fail if you fail. And since they put their job and or their career at risk, they're loath to do that just to be a nice person and give you a chance. What are you going to take a chance on in this equation? That you're going to fail? That's not enough because, frankly, there's a big universe out there. They can find someone with better experience if that's the issue. So, again, if you're early in the search, or I should say if they are early in the search, this probably isn't anything that can work. However, if they've been interviewing for a while, a few months, certainly not a year, they're, they've demonstrated that they're very fussy about who they want to hire, it's going to fall on deaf ears. But if they've been at this for two months and they're still interviewing, they may have discovered or you may be able to explain to them that perhaps what they are looking for is a needle in a haystack and that what you're willing to do is come on board, lesser salary, demonstrate your effort, desire, passion, hunger to do this well. Maybe you'll pay for some training to get yourself up to speed in whatever the perceived deficiency is, but you really want to do this. And you know, maybe they could have you puppy dog with someone uh, where you're working closely with someone who might provide some oversight to you to help get you up to speed. Whatever it is, you have to put in some effort. But like I said, if this is the beginning of their search or they've been engaged for a ridiculously long period of time, forget about it. There's nothing in it for them. Again, there's that sweet spot in the middle between the beginning of the search and it's been going on for an eternity where you have that possibility. But even then, the odds are very, very small because their career is at risk. I'm Jeff Alpin, The Big Game Hunter, and if you're interested in one-on-one -on -one coaching from me, email me at jeffalpin at thebiggamehunter.us, and in the subject line, put the word coaching. You know, what I do is work with people over a period of time as your ally in the search, because after all, when you think about it, who's there to help you? An employer? They don't have your interests at heart. The recruiter? I don't think so. They have their interest at heart and their clients interested in heart, but you know, they're just trying to earn a fee. I work for you to try and help you land work more quickly. And you know, if that sort of sustained effort doesn't make sense for you, I also do a job search makeover where we sit down for one session hour, hour and 15 of time, I dissect what you've been doing, help you perform at a better level. Again, I'm Jeff Alpin, The Big Game Hunter. If you want a makeover, if you want coaching, email me at jeffalpin at thebiggamehunter.us. Put the word coaching or put the word job search makeover in the subject line. We'll schedule time to talk. Have a great day. Take care.